paying only 20% video as a part of promotion. For remaining 80%, that is 6 to 8 articles, current affairs video and general studies complete videos, please subscribe to our complete package. 1. After an Indian temple chief recently said, he would allow women to enter the shrine, only after a machine was invented to detect if they were pure, meaning that they weren't menstruating. Outraged women have launched a Happy to Bleed campaign on Facebook, to protest against the sexist statement. Why is menstruation a religious taboo in India? Why are Indian women happy to bleed? GS Paper 1 Salient Features of Indian Society Discrimination of Women Why recently in news? Students who are a part of the Happy to Bleed campaign has asked the Supreme Court why the healthy biological process of menstruation is used in the name of religion to discriminate against women. The students want the apex court to address and decide on whether modern society should continue to bear with menstrual discrimination when the Indian constitution mandates right to equality and health of women to achieve gender justice. The students have asked how a religious taboo that prohibits the entry of women aged between 10 and 50 years to the Sabarimala temple continues to be widely accepted and even justified by the authorities in violation of the rights of women under Articles 14 and 15 of the Constitution. The SC had asked whether the Vedas, Upanishads and scriptures discriminate between men and women. Why is menstruation a religious taboo in India? Hinduism regards menstruating women as unclean so, during her periods, a woman is not allowed to enter the temple, touch any idols, enter the kitchen or even touch the pickle jar. Many Hindu temples in India, and also globally, have prominent notices displayed at the entrance telling menstruating women that they are not welcome, and many devout Hindu women voluntarily keep away from temples when they are menstruating. But the Sabarimala bars all women in the reproductive age from entering the temple. The temple website explains that as Lord Ayappa was Nitya Brahmachari, or celibate, women between the 1050 age group are not allowed to enter Sabarimala. Why are Indian women happy to bleed? Happy to bleed has received a lot of responses, especially from young urban Indian women. Some, however, have also wondered how women can be happy to bleed since periods can often be pretty painful. They are using happy as a word to express sarcasm, as a satire, to taunt the authorities, the patriarchal forces which attach impurity with menstruation. It may be painful, but it's perfectly normal to bleed and it does not make me impure. More than 100 women have posted their photographs on Facebook holding banners and placards, with catchy slogans, and many more have shared these photos on their timelines.